Hey everyone, and welcome back to another Dragon Ball Legends video. My name is D Free. Here today, we are going to be showing off Super Vegito's brand new equip. So this man is going to be in action here today. I hope you guys enjoy today's video. Of course, hit that subscribe if you are new for more content. And let's just go ahead and go over it very briefly here. So this is the new equip I am talking about, a new unique equipment item for Vegito. You guys can't check out the stats here. So we're going to be using him on fusions alongside the Super Saiyan team as well. We're going to do a couple of matches here and see what we can really do. See how we can show this man off but without further ado i want to go ahead and jump into today's video but first we have a very quick word from our sponsors for the video One of the most ambitious RPG projects of 2019 has just been released and it's going to change everything you think you know about mobile games introducing raid shadow legends raid is easily among the most immersive experiences you'll ever find on a smartphone it can only really be compared with the biggest pc and console titles raids graphics and storyline are comparable to triple a console releases but the game is free to play raid just came out and there are already around 10 million players worldwide in just over three months man look how crazy the level of detail is in these champions i never expected to get graphics this good from a mobile game. In Raid, you can personally customize each aspect of your champions, from a completely unique artifact setup to custom mastery builds for every champion. It really doesn't matter. You can build each champion exactly how you want them. What I love most about Raid is that there's something for everyone, honestly. If you love Hero Collection, Raid's got you covered. If you love deep, complex gameplay, Raid's got you covered. Well, how about competitive arena PvP? Guess what? Raid's got you. Amazing graphics? Raid. Deep storyline, you get the picture. And it already has more than 300,000 reviews and an almost perfect score on the Play Store. Raid is getting big really fast and the huge faction war feature just dropped. It's live, you can play it right now. And if that's not enough, there is a crazy login rewards program to help new players settle in and get started. Download it now through the link in the video description to get 100,000 silver, 50 gems, one energy refill, and the free champion, Executioner as part of the new player program and these rewards will be available for the next 30 days So good luck everyone, and I'll see you in the game All right, our old friend yellow yellow blue We're gonna go ahead and jump in versus yellow yellow blue and uh, we'll be right back in just a moment All right, let's get into it. So this is obviously not the best match for our man Vegito But we'll try to make it work the thing about that team is even though it uh, it does lack some of the stars that my team has, it is still pretty stacked because of the powerful Z ability bonuses of units like Broly and stuff. So it, it can still be pretty tough to fight this team, especially because Hit can come in and just do a ton of damage, bro. All right, we're going to go ahead and get started here. I need to just kind of switch immediately so I can get that Vegito uh, base form one queued back up ASAP. All right, so here we go. My charge steps have been pretty bad thus far. Um, we'll see if we can fix that. <laughs> All right, let me go here. I actually could have uh, absorbed that, but that's okay. I'm going to go green. Okay. That's a decent amount of strike damage for one hit from Vegito, man. Decent start for him. All right. Yeah, that's that's not bad damage considering disadvantage. Oh, okay. I thought he was going to go right into it. I guess not. <laughs> blast card, maybe? Interesting. Transformation. And there was a blast card. That's fine, though. Strike. Oh, okay. Not bad. Let me go for a tackle. Strike. So him coming in there actually changed what card I was going to get. So I wasted my ultimate basically there. We're going to go for a rush on hit. He might force out Broly. There's the Broly. I'm not going to go green because green is far too obvious. <laughs> it's far too obvious. Um, Please don't choose Blast. Thank you. Yeah, green is far too obvious. All right. So, goodbye, Broly. Bakana! All right. Um, I'm going to go ahead and don't mind if I do. Thank you. Go for a blast. All right. There we go. Now, it's time to bring Super Vegito in for the home stretch of this fight. Let's see if he has what it takes to bring down this man uh, hit here. Ah, All right. We'll be right back, everyone, in just a moment. <laughs> so this matchup is versus the movies team. And again, this is going to be a tough matchup, though, because Gohan and Bojack are there, and it's a good setup. So we'll see what we can do. 
I'm going to, for this one, pretty much just play around those two. So I think I'll actually bring into this one Go Tanks as well. So let's go ahead and do it. Single? Okay. It didn't matter. I'll actually go into him here. Go Tanks is close enough. Ah! <laughs> Famous last words. I, I, this is why I generally like to wait. Give me that blast. There we go. I saw all those strike animations. Oh, boy. Oh, God. <laughs> I can't use the unit. They're not letting me play. I don't blame them. I'd be salty as heck, too, if I got guessed there. Look at the screen just shaking. We're going to try a couple more times. Oh, man. It'd be... It'd be a shame if I was allowed to actually play with Super Vegito. We have another yellow, yellow, blue matchup. Okay. Okay. Um, Gohan. Okay, you're not bad. Not a bad uh setup for him to begin with there. Obviously, th those units were gonna come, but the order that he chose, not a bad order. I'm gonna switch here immediately. Try to get some damage, Vegito. Go! Hits coming in, but we can body hit. I don't care. He's not the tankiest unit. You can do it. And also, I sneak some damage in on the Goku, which is nice. It's going to go ahead and stop here. All right. We're going to go for that. I thought I backed out of that. That's fine, though. Got a perfect. And then we turn that into a combo. Gohan comes back in. There he is. So Gohan has damage cut. I'm just not going to do anything to him. So it's not even worth wasting my time. Oh, okay. I tried to wait for his second sidestep that he did not go for. He probably has a rush now queued up, and the Bardock is a prime candidate to get rushed. <laughs> He's, I would rush the Bardock without hesitation, to be honest, if I were him. All right. Oh, okay, my strike card did not want to queue up in time. It took its time. All right. We'll go here. Hits in now. Interesting. I'm going to go for my ult here. Gohan probably comes in. There he is. That's fine, though. Let's get my ults. We're critting. Let's see how much we can do to the Gohan. That's some really good damage. I'm going to go ahead and switch him out, though, because he's going to lock me. I'm going to lock him, though. I'm going to go blast. He can dodge that, but that's fine. Or not. I got him just in time, I guess. Or maybe he dropped his guard. I'm going to throw the rush here. He's going to be forced to lose one of those units here. Yeah, there we go. I didn't care if it was LF Goku or this Gohan, because this Gohan has actually a ton of buffs. LF Goku's annoying, but I didn't I didn't really care which one. All right. So goodbye, Gohan. Yeah, that Gohan is really annoying to play against. He's really good. Really, really good unit. Okay, there we go. Ah, I clicked it early. <laughs> Okay, if he goes for a strike, though, here, I have it. Oh, a crit on the knockback. That's funny. I'm going to go single. That's fine. He's going to go ahead and be uh, queued up for his shenanigans here. I'll go strike. I figured a tackle would be coming in. He's actually, every time we've had those exchanges, he's gone straight for a tackle. So, we're getting a crit here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ah, uh, that one that one just took a little bit longer than I needed. All right. And uh, come on, Vegito. That's lame. That's super lame. Come on, bro. You got to be able to finish that from that range. I'm not mad at him, though. Yeah, no, that's not going to hit me. Ah, oh, I thought the little smidge movement thing he did was a sidestep. All right, that's fine, though. At least I avoided the rush. That doesn't mean I win or anything, because this guy still does shenanigans like this. He can actually one-shot me if I let him, so. All right, so Bardock is back. That means I can abuse that. I'm going to go for a single blast. Or tap, excuse me. So now it's just more or less playing around this guy. So, okay, he got me there. I'm going to bring you in here. Because I knew that wouldn't do enough. Oh, come on! <laughs> the second I queued it up, he clicked another one. That was supreme luck, bro. Oh. Oh. Okay, then. Okay, then. <laughs> Good game for sure, man.
Vegito, Vegito was out there showing out, man. That's that's one of the better matches I've had in this whole recording session. We've been on, obviously, um, you guys have seen a couple of matches, but I've been on a, a pretty long recording session win streak here. Um, we're going to switch back to Fusion to see if we can get a match with that team. Okay, so this is a matchup versus a Saiyan team. Pretty much, sun it's, it's just Goku's, so however you want to end the Vegeta there. Um, I want to try to leave my man out here a little bit longer. The thing about Vegito is you want to leave him out there as long as possible. It's just not that it, it's just that it's not always super easy to do that, right? You want to leave him out there so he can replenish his hand, get constant buffs and stuff like that, but it's not always the most easy thing to do. So I will try to do that here. We'll be right back, everyone, in just a moment. Or not. Oh, ho, 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 we're versus Ginyu Force. They are approaching me, man, and this is going to be... Oh, you're approaching me? This is going to be fun. This is going to be fun for sure. We'll be right back. Okay, let's see who he chose. I assumed, yep, there's the birder. I assumed a birder would come. Birder's too good, man. He's really good. So let me go ahead and bring out Vegito here instantly. All right, so we're gonna get some hits in on the Ginyu Goku. Okay, go green here. So is he. I don't see anything happening. I'm gonna back out here. I assume maybe a tackle? No tackle, okay, that's fine. Oh, okay. That, like, kind of just flew right through him. Okay. What? What is happening? What, what, what was happening? I assume Birder comes in here. I want to stay just as long as I can, man. Interesting switch. I would have let the Ginyu Goku take some hits, to be honest. I got to switch here, though. Oh, he vanished already. Nice. Perfect. I thought he was sidestepping, not switching. I thought that was a sidestep. Okay, this is fine though. This guy will recover all of this damage pretty much, so I'm not worried about that. Oh, I did not expect that peekaboo rising rush face. I'll go blast. Special move, obviously. Freaking Birder does so much damage. This unit is so good. Why is Birder so good? He's gonna KO a red unit that has defense. Look, this unit is so tanky. Vegito is so tanky and he's getting KO'd by Birder. Dog. <laughs> Birder is so good. He is such a good card. Every time I see him in action, I'm just like, why did they make him so stupid with his special moves? They do so much damage. His special moves do an absurd amount of damage. We basically need to be carried here by Super Vegito, funnily enough. I have no buffs, so I'm not even going to bother using my ulti or anything. I would like to get the HP heal on it, so I'm not even going to bother with it. I'll have to take some hits. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Go, Tanks! <laughs> Come in! <laughs> Oh, no! <laughs> this Birder almost won combo in my Super Vegito. I can't let that happen. Oh, I tried to delay that. Dog! Birder coming off that Ginyu switch? Oh, my goodness. This man has so much key, he can do whatever he wants all the time. The whole game, he's been able to do whatever. He's always had the key for everything. Well, we really got to get carried here. This is the end. That's going to hit. Change! Aha! Uh -huh, gotcha. Man, oh man. I'm going to stop the clock here. Single. Gotcha. Bring out that birder. Bring out the birder. Do it. Oh, you're going to let him die, huh? Bring out the birder, man. Do it. Oh, I have my rush still. Oh, boy. I wanted to be able to use Super Vegito, and here we are. Aha! Oh, you're approaching me, brother! Ah, I clicked the wrong button! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my! <laughs> oh, I can back out! Okay, I accidentally tapped it. I didn't mean to. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Please, brother, don't do it! <laughs> oh my god. All right. All right. No, 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 no. <laughs> I actually, I meant to go. I, okay. So what happened was I was going to go charge step out of, out of habit. Right. But I intended to go green first. 
and then go rush. But my part of my brain was saying, no, charge step. Try to keep this going. You know, use that ultimate or whatever. But I, I, I think I had a green card. Anyways, I wanted to. I basically wanted to go rush, <laughs> just to end it there. And so I wound up turning into me tapping the middle of the screen. <laughs> We got the win though. Super Vegito was able to get that 1v3 comeback, I believe, there. I just was like, man, oh my god, do not. Birder is one of the best EXs in the game. My extension makes him one of the better characters in the game, too. He does a, a ridiculous amount of damage. It doesn't make sense. So um, I'm happy I was able to show Vegito off. In throughout the video, funnily enough, Vegito was matched up with a lot of yellow units. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Must be a trick. He was matched up with a lot of yellow units, which is pretty awesome to be all, all things considered So the equip like kind of patches up his blast defense or a blast attack Excuse me. So this is what we kind of had working a lot of strike attack But this one here is blast attack mainly unless you get the the cover For strike attack so you can you can do the cover knockback Which I'm always really bad with the timing of those but it should work on regular covers too You can go ahead and rewind the footage, but the most important skill here is slot two and uh, the ultimate on slot three. Those are the most important things because he, this guy, Vegito, gets so many buffs just for existing. Every single card he draws gives him a buff. So, like, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> um, so, he's going to do, he's still, this is, this is, the equip's going to be so much better post awakening. It's not even funny. Like, it, it, any marginal changes to that equip make it just too good. So, anyways, thank you all for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Hit that subscribe if you are new for more content. And I'll catch all of you guys in the next one.